in any city, in any country. Go to any mental institution or halfway house you can get yourself to. When you reach the front desk, ask to see someone who calls himself the holder of envy. Should the worker look like he'll cry and starts nodding softly, he will take you to a basement with a steel hatch and tell you to walk down. The worker will close the hatch and leave you with a loud noise. Once you've walked down the stairs, you'll be in a long, dark hallway. On the other side is the door you're headed to. As you come closer to the door, the hallway gets darker and you'll hear a scratching sound. That gets louder with every step you take. Once it gets so dark you can't see the door anymore, and the scratching stops. Close your eyes and walk in a straight line while humming a child's song of any choice. If you don't do this, you're doomed to walk the hallway forever without your sight. Once you feel the blessing of a weak light upon your eyes, it's safe to open them. But don't look back at the darkness or you'll still meet a never-ending fate in the hallway. When you've reached the door, knock twice and open it before you'll hear an answer, or the door will never open. When you enter the room, you'll see a table full of scratches, standing in the middle of a dark room with a candle as the only light source. Behind the table sits a man, a forgotten king. He wears a black robe, and a small crown with diamonds colored red like blood. Get closer to him, but not to close. He will only answer one question. How will they be remembered? The king will stand up, face toward you, and will look you in your eyes. His eyes are pitch black and blood is running down his cheeks. He'll slowly walk towards you. Don't break eye contact with him or he'll rip your eyes out and pin them to the wall to look into nothing for eternity. As he comes closer, you'll start to see a vague vision blocking your sight, but still don't move your eyes as the vision becomes clearer to you. You'll see the fate of this poor king tormented by his own people in horrific ways that will make you shiver. If you manage to keep your mind strong, the vision will fade. Once your sight turns back to normal, the king will be right in front of you. He will be so close you can feel his cold breath, don't get startled or scared. The slightest move or sound will disappoint the king, and he'll slit your throat with his long, sharp nails. He'll take your hand and put a beautiful black necklace in it. He'll point at a wooden door that wasn't there before, that leads to a large forest. Getting to the king was the easy part. Will you survive the trip to safety? This black necklace is object for 156 of 538. Never bring the objects together.